Dynamic Front is a combined combat arms training exercise led by the U.S. Army consisting of multiple nations within NATO. The objective of this exercise was to test the interoperability and also the integration of uh, multinational units at the tactical level fires and also uh, theater level fires. What we brought here to Dynamic Front is we brought a battery of M777 uh, towed howitzers and we also brought a platoon of HIMARS. So the importance of firing uh, the Mike 142 HIMARS, uh, you know, there's a lot of uh, countries here in Europe that, that aren't familiar with the weapon system. It was really good for them to be able to see, see the system, see how it's employed, um, and understand how it is controlled. The M777 portion of Dynamic Front uh, pretty much had us shoot, move, and communicate. We moved in a foreign country that we're not familiar with, so being out here was definitely good training for us. Probably the biggest challenge was uh, the cold weather environment. We had to do a lot of uh, training prior to coming here, and then just enduring, uh, adjusting our work tempo. Um, that's, a, that's a huge challenge that we were able to overcome. So this was a really big deal for the reserve members to be able to come, uh, you know, and so to get out of, so to get out of our own backyard and come someplace that we weren't used to training was very helpful for them. Uh, in the reserves, we have the luxury of people in different fields inside their civilian sector. So when they come to the table, we don't just have firefighters and police officers, we have electricians, we have mechanics, we have engineers, we have computer programmers, things of that nature, and everything that they can bring to the table is all that much more when we're able to deploy.